Uh, and I'm gonna really try it once again. Hey guys, this is Latch and welcome to the new giveaway tool. Now it's named Latch Tool actually for some new because there's a lot of new features. So we're gonna start with the, the first one is the, the giveaway one. So if you're familiar with our giveaway tools, uh, you know the one with the monster and the Mega Man theme that goes like wah, 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 wah. So I just added a couple of feature based on your feedback actually And I'm just gonna jump right at it But mainly the first one is you can now connect with twitch like this and once you are connected with twitch You can finally have a comment to be automatically adding into the list So if I go like this, I'm gonna leave this empty Voila, so now if people here right now on my twitch uh, write some stuff that will appear in the list of participants automatically and uh, same thing with the countdown animation the thing with the little monster that goes like uh, people can now auto claim just by being on the chat instead of having to watch the chat and everything because I had some fellow streamers with like thousands of viewers oh there you go the pet user are winning the pet user in eBay 91 also Emberro and Vince Strickland everybody it is working woo so, uh, yeah, when you have like thousands of viewers, it was impossible to try to follow the chat and see like, uh, is he present and blah, 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 you know? So now it's just automatically gonna work. Uh, the rest is the same, so share here, back here, blah, blah, blah. But you may have noticed a little bar over here. So, again, it's called a latch tool for some reason, because now it is a tool that I use for myself. Uh, I was using several tools for my alerts. Um, I was using T-Board for the follow alerts and also I made a bunch of uh, tools for myself for the donation and for the cheers and blah 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 and I just realized that I'm pretty <laughs> I just realized I'm pretty I just realized that uh, with a couple of more hours I could give that for the rest uh, of streamers I could give that to anybody so I'm gonna jump at it actually we have a bunch of alerts so the first one is the follow alerts, sub alerts and host alerts so it's always gonna ask you like uh, what you need um, what you need to do so right now it says like I can find the widget is XSplit or OBS open because now it's working with both uh, so I'm gonna open OBS it's kind of a stream within the stream we need to go deeper so we're gonna see like my pretty face look at that is my pretty pretty Movember face from last year so now that I've connected, you can see that put it's got been connected to widget. Let's try that again, just once again. I'm gonna put that a little bit smaller just for the laws, like this, and I'm gonna open OBS just so you can see that it's automatic. And voila! It had open, you know, it detects that now I'm connected to OBS right over here, and um, and yeah, so. Actually, yeah, I made something uh, very fast. I'm gonna remove the latch tool over here. Remove, yes, put. So I removed it and now it's not there anymore. So now if you want to install it, it says like widget not found. If you click how to install, you can install it on XBit or OBS. Basically, it's very easy. You just go on your user document slash latch tools. So if I go over there and I go to latch tools, I got my widget over there and for, hey, Get back here for OBS. I need the HTML this one So I'm gonna take the HTML and can I just drag it here? No, I can't all right So this I'm gonna do browser source Like this. Oh, and we got black fat and tills following the channel Welcome aboard man. That's the kind of the handlers that we can have on your channel actually So if I go like latch tool widget boop, voila Local file browse you go on your documents into latch tools and you take the HTML5. Now you have to, on OBS, you have to do that little extra step. You put it at 1280.720. Boop. You just put that all the way around. Boop. Like this. And voila. Connected to widget. And everything opens after that, you know. <clears throat> so if we can just test it out, I'm going to do a test. Boop. Voila. It's right over there, so I can test the follow alerts and the sub alerts and the host alerts. And the cool thing is you can see all your followers over here. You can see your total of followers, your subs. So if you want to redo an animation for somebody that uh, that sub like yesterday or sub offline or something, 
you can click on him and go ahead and just like click alert. So I'm gonna show it like on my full screen. So instead of showing it on the OBS one, uh, hang on, like this. Mithras has joined the battle. So this is my subscriber, my sub uh, alerts, and I actually give it to you. So at any point here, you can just click test. And voila, it appears right over there, you know? And now I'm gonna shut it up, I'm gonna click stop all on him. Ah, I thought it was working. Meh. Well, it is working, but it's gonna stop after. Alright. So I got this one, I also have the uh, host alert. Yay! And this one is pretty big, but if you have under 10 viewers, it's not gonna be as big. It's only gonna be like a bunch of uh, little gloves that goes like, yay, like this, but not as much. Uh, yeah, 38, zero viewers. There, I'm gonna take this one for zero viewers. So if it's under 10 viewers, you know, uh, it's, it's gonna be a more subtle one. But when it's something like, oh my god, 38! And Spector, oh my god! So this, and also the donation ones, is my favorite. The donation, I really like it. So now it connects to stream tips. I want it to connect to multiple source. Like I think that the stream alerts also, stream labs also have it, uh, Twitch alert. Uh, I was connect I was using stream tips like two years ago and I've been using them ever since. And it's just like, it's there because that's what I was using, right? But uh, I understand if you guys need more source, I might work on it when I'll have time uh, but yeah basically you have your donation here and the cool thing is you can put some goals uh, you can put a recurrent goals and a big goals so for example um, my plane tickets to TwitchCon you know so let's do a twi plane tickets to TwitchCon let's say that it's a thousand for example <laughs> now I have a new follower yay uh, and it's probably gonna appear here as well anyway so you go like my tickets to TwitchCon and uh, what I do on my channel is every time I get a hundred dollar I do a giveaway so I'm gonna do like give away every a hundred bucks you know so I go like this I go apply and save and let's say I receive a donation I'm gonna receive a donation of 30 over here I click on a donation I do it with collect Boop. I have the other one hang on Boop. Boop. The name and the, the description is right over there. Demo! <laughs> get away, Demo! Get away! Welcome aboard, Demo Man. So, you can see both the old thing. It's also the first donation of the day. There's first donation of the day, first donation of the week, the month, and top of all time. So, they get medals whenever they reach a new goal. And uh, yeah, you can have like a recurrent goal like this. So, let's say, for example, I have. 70 like this and I collect a $62 Let's get down to business to defeat the light show Oh, come on. Oh, I forgot to put <laughs> I forgot to put save That's a very bad tutorial. All right, let's do it again. Put put All right Let's get down to business to defeat the light show Way, a giveaway and it goes back up blah 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 you know and then when it reach a thousand bucks uh you know there's like big uh, big explosions and stuff like that so i'm gonna let you discover that and also you can put a percentage to charity that's something i did as well you can say like okay i want to calculate 10 percent that goes to a charity and then you end all the rest by yourself you know uh, so I made a bunch of charity uh, thing over there, the most not popular one, but you know, I made a bunch of uh, uh, one that we donated here on this channel. Uh, so you can do that as well. Uh, and last is the cheer alerts. Uh, very simple, but uh, I like it as well. I'm just going to pop it up uh, like this. Yay! I'm actually going to show it to you here on my face. So every cheer that you get is a cannon that goes like boom, 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 boom. And the little monster, the same monster that they give away, just appear at the bottom, tries to eat all the bits and then burps. No, it didn't burp this one. Rock, paper, man, how you doing? Thank you very much for the follow. 
Come on, give me all the bits. I want it to burp. <laughs> I make everything lag. Okay, is it gonna... Yay, it has burped. Beautiful, beautiful. So, yeah, and now the cool thing is all those animation is, uh, you know, is uh, pre-recorded. So that means that you can all use those one. This is my alerts, but I'm just giving it to you guys. Uh, so you can just use it, but you can also use your own custom animation. So when you do that, you can see that all the alerts here, they all have the little uh, widget over here called the Devo animation, blah, 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 like this. Uh, so you just click on this, for example, for the sub one, you go like this, custom animation, and then you browse. And now the cool thing is inside the last tool, inside the, uh, the uh, installed folder, you're gonna see a little folder called custom animation example. And I gave you all the animation that I have, except for new donation, because the donation thing has a lot of code in it. And it will have been a nightmare to put that directly on the timeline. And you know, I have my own stuff, my own way to code stuff. So basically, it's all baked within the last tools. But the rest is all there, and you can uh, you can change it. So for example, if you want to change it by yourself, you just go again. You go onto your C, your program file, uh, latch tools over here, custom animation example, and let's open up, for example, uh, sub. So you use animate CC because Flash is dead. Ha 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 ha. Okay, so here you see the animation right over there. That's my animation. Ah, because I'm using it. Okay, whatever. Shut up. Okay. So I have my animation over here, the text fill is right over here, and on the first frame here, if you press F9, on the very fr first frame, you already have the code to connect the two. So this is the code that I use that the Latch Tools will send, the value that the, that the Latch Tools will send to this Swift, so we can uh, display the correct name, display the correct sub, uh, sub name and the, the amount of month and etc, etc. And I made that for all the examples. So even the donation, if you go in there, I made a, uh, I made one and you can see like what is the amount of the recur goal, the target, is it enabled, what's the reward, blah, 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 blah. So basically all the information that you put in the latch tool over here, in the donation, for example, all of this information here is going to be passed to that little Swift. So then you can do whatever animation that you want to do. Um, so yeah, this is the kind of tool that I wanted to, that I wished I had when I started streaming. You know, just uh, something that I can make my own animation, plug that in, and voila, the rest is all uh, is all done. You know, so I made it by myself, and then I said, you know what, I'm going to give it to everybody. So now, if you want, there's one thing, two things left to be uh, talk, to talk about. Uh, if you need some arts, if you need some animation, uh, you can ask those two guys here, Emily and Mark. I love them. Very awful. Very awful. Wow! That's a, a very awesome. <laughs> very awful. Okay, let's cut that. Beep. Very awesome and skillful. All right, not awful. Very awesome and skillful artist <laughs> Emily and Mark so basically if you like the animation and the alerts that we have already those guys are the genius behind it all right I'm just a coder I'm a simple coder and I and I mess up with numbers not art they are awesome and I also put my info over here so if you if you need help or whatever but now guys there's one last thing I'm gonna say a catch uh, the thing is I spent Thousands of dollars for real. I, yeah, people are like fired, fired. <laughs> that was beautiful. So I spend a lot of money in that project. Uh, I spoke with my accountant very uh, uh, lately, and she said that I spent like several thousands of dollars in that project. Uh, you know, asking for Emily for interface or Mark for alerts and. And you know, lots of time as well, hundreds of hours to develop develop that tool and everything. So I spent a lot and a lot of time. So in exchange, what I did is uh, those alerts over here. You need to be sub on Game Wisp. I have I have a Game Wisp page over here uh, called the Latch Tools over here. So there's two uh, there's two tier that you can have here to get all the alerts and everything. Um, 
But uh, yeah, if you just sub on this, you will have access for all the alerts and everything. And also I can support you, you know. So there's that. But, you know, I know when I was starting to stream, I didn't have much money. So I gave you another opportunity. You can also promote my game because I make my my uh, dispel to it. Um, I make, uh, you know, my main focus here is to uh, make games, you know, my main a source of revenue is to make games. So right now we're working on two different games, Zombial and Just Ships and Beats. And I just said like, you know, if you just uh, try to, if you just help me out to promote my games somehow, I don't know how, uh, probably gonna put like a, a Steam page with a wish list or something like that. But if you just like help me out on this, I'm gonna unlock the uh, the whole thing for free, you know? So that's just like a little win-win, how to help me out uh, with this, you know? One thing I want to add is, uh, you know, if you don't have, if you don't want to spend money for that tool, I just wanted to say that I don't want to get rich with that tool. It's not my, it's not my intent, you know? My main focus is to make, is to make game, is to work on Just Ships and Beats and on Vital. And I highly prefer that, for example, if you just, promote my game or just talk about my game to 20 people, 50 people or whatever your target audience is. If you just talk about my stuff, it is way more valuable to me than a hundred bucks, you know? So spread the words and I will unlock the uh, the alerts uh, for you for free, you know? So, yeah, was there anything else I needed to say? I don't believe so. Uh, yeah. That's it. If you want more info, I, there's my Discord server as well. Uh, just go on my channel. I don't have the Discord here. But, uh, you know, contact me on Twitter. That would be the best way to do it. And, uh, yeah, have fun with it. Bye.